my goodness, this has been way harder than I thought. And part of the reason is I have uh, just one or two pieces of scrap steel. And I really had to do some uh, major Yankee engineering to make this work. I can say that because I'm a Yankee. Uh, this is a bed rail, a, a bed rail. And man, they are hardened. It took a forever to drill through these, but I got the table mounted solid. Now, what I did was weld a piece behind this, drill through here, which was also hard. And uh, let me show you how square I got this. It took forever to get, get it this way. I had to put some shims and washers and Anyway, I have finally got it square, square and plumb. And this way, and this way, square to the table. Okay, I'm gonna put a brand new belt on it and uh, this job is done. And I've made up my mind, I'm gonna keep this until it breaks. I'm not talking about if a bearing, these bearings are easy to replace. So, I mean, if a bearing goes out, I'll replace it. I'm, since I got a belt off, let me check the bearings. Yeah, they're good. So, you know, if the motor quits, if the, if the cast iron breaks or something, uh, I will step up to the 2 by 72 and I've got my mind made up. It's going to be an Amera, Amera braid, but uh, I'm going to keep this until it won't, won't keep on anymore. It's uh, made a lot of knives and it deserves to live out its life in safety and happiness making knives. Okay, uh, I, was, I had another project. I'm going to run an outlet out where underneath my new carport uh, I'm gonna run an outlet where I have I can plug my table saw and my miter saw in and uh, that way I don't have to have a bunch of extension cords and stuff like that so but I'm not gonna do that today I have all the parts and components and uh, today is Sunday if tomorrow's a nice day uh, I'm probably gonna go riding we haven't rode in a while and this carport uh, back here. That carport back there. I am out of money. So I, uh, I, I'm not going to be able to build that for a while. But that's all right. Uh, I just wanted to park my equipment under it. Right now in my garage, I got two motorcycles, my John Deere, my wife's garden tractor. We got the, uh, in that little shed there, we got the ZTR lawnmower. And uh, it'll be all right till I can round up the funds to build this. I'm thinking I can do it for, well, today, a thousand bucks. But a week from now, who knows, the way lumber's going up, it might be 3,000. Anyway, I'm gonna get a new belt on this. I give you one more shot of it all cleaned up with a belt on it and uh, that is my day see you tomorrow or not or if i do see you tomorrow i'll i'll take some uh motorcycle footage have a good monday y'all all right let me turn it on it's i'll tell you it's even a little quieter Got way less vibration than it used to have. So that table must flopping around must have been really adding to the, the noise because it is much quieter. Okay, new belt. Fixing to put a new belt on you. You're getting a new belt. Not today, but soon you're getting a new disc because uh, it is an hour worth of work getting that thing off, getting all the old adhesive off and uh, putting a new disc on. At least a half an hour. Whole table's got to come off. It's a pain in the neck. Okay. I'm going to take a break. Drink some water. <sighs> See you tomorrow. I'll tell you what I'm going to do here. I'm putting an outlet on that pole about halfway up. 
run the wire up here and uh, into that outlet. And then I'm gonna move that table down here and the table saw and that are coming way down here. So, okay, now I'm going home.